Hi, it's Gemma from Create Studio. Welcome to another crafty DIY at home session. Today we're making a bottle dragon. Here's what you'll need. Grab a clean plastic bottle, an old sock no one any longer needs. Make sure you check with mom and dad first. And some glue for assembling some of the parts of your project. You'll also need some newspaper to stuff the sock. And some things you find around the house that you think might be in fun to include on your dragon. We've got candy wrappers, shredded documents, twigs and sticks, feathers, and some packing foam. Now you're going to start adding elements to the inside of your bottle. Choose things that you think would be fun to see from the outside, but would be part of the inside of your dragon. Once you get it stuffed about halfway, you'll be ready to move on to the next part of the project. Grab the sock and some of the newspaper. You're going to use the newspaper to stuff the sock, so you're going to want to take pieces of it and smash them up really small so they can fit inside the sock to stuff it. And you're only going to need to stuff it about halfway. This is going to be the dragon's head and part of the body. Go ahead and take the sock and pull it over the top of the dragon's body, the bottle, about halfway so that it's fastened securely on but doesn't cover the bottom of the bottle. Now you're ready to decorate the outside. You can try water bottle lids like Maisie did here. They make great eyes. You can even add other parts to the inside to make them more in depth. Maisie chose buttons for hers. Looks great. Now it looks like she's going to use some packing foam to make spines on the back of her dragon. But you can use other things that you think are interesting to do the same thing. This is a super easy project, a lot of fun to do by yourself or with mom or dad or brothers or sisters or grandmas and grandpas or even aunts and uncles. And you can add as many different things as you like to it to make it your own special dragon. Looks like Maisie's going to add candy wrappers or gum wrappers. I think she's going to use those to make wings. And that will complete her dragon project, but you can keep going on yours. You could add other things to make feet for your dragon or teeth for your dragon or even fire to breathe from the dragon. Thanks for joining us for a fun project today. We hope you have a great time creating your own dragon. Catch us next time for our next DIY at home project. Enjoy. Thanks for watching.